The president of the Mobile City Council has passed away. LaVon Manzi was just 38. He had been on the council for eight years. Gabby Easterwood is at Government Plaza live with reaction to Manzi's death. Gabby? Well, Devin, friends, family, and colleagues all say that they're heartbroken and shocked. A longtime servant of Mobile, dead at 38. I couldn't believe it. Council member Gina Gregory, working alongside LaVon Manzi his entire time on council, where he served as vice president and most recently president. She says service was at the center of his life. We were, we were more than colleagues. LaVon and I were friends, and he was always very easy to work with. LaVon always had this big smile and an infectious laugh. Before his time on council in 2008, he was the youngest person ever elected to the Mobile County Board of School Commissioners. He was also a religious leader, a longtime reverend at St. Joseph Baptist Church in Whistler. LaVon worked very hard for his district and um, having a church, you know, LaVon understood that there was a, there's a blessing in unity. And so that's why he was always trying to be that peacemaker. The Manzi family sent us a statement saying in part, quote, he was truly a living servant of the people. We feel LaVon was taken from us too soon, but his work and accomplishments will continue to make a tremendous mark on the city of Mobile. No cause of death has been released, but at the age of 14, Manzi was diagnosed with kidney failure. Over the years, he's had to have two kidney transplants, but he never let any ailments slow him down. He has persevered through these health challenges, I think just speaks of, of the kind of man that he was, you know, that he was able to keep going and keep serving his community, didn't let anything get him down. You know, not everybody can do that. Now, as for the upcoming runoff election for District 2, LaVon Manzi's name will still be on the ballot. And if he gets